Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the topic related with the perfect frame and the imperfect frame. So this is uh, from strength of materials. So we have to know what is meant by perfect frame and the imperfect frame. So we know the frame is there. So is there any frame? So there are uh, joints over here. So these are all the joints and these are members. So this is uh, joints denoted as uh, J and uh, member denoted as N. We know the perfect frame and the imperfect frame having the condition. So the whenever the condition satisfies that is N equal to 2J minus 3 it is satisfies it called perfect frame. So this condition not satisfies that is called imperfect frame. So there are two types in imperfect frame. So that is if n value is less than 2j minus 3 that is called deficient frame. So n is greater than 2j minus 3 that is called redundant frame. So for example we can take this one we having the joints over here this is member so this is j and this is n so there are three number of members are there and joints are one two three so three joints are there so we can substitute in this equation so n equal to three equal to two into j is three minus three so three equal to six minus three so three equal to three so that is equal so the condition is satisfied that is called perfect frame okay so for imperfect frame we can uh, choose the uh, frame like this so now there are four joints are there so j equal to four so numbers also four so n equal to four so there are four members so now equal to four equal to so that is n four equal to 2j so 2 into 4 minus 3 so now 4 equal to 8 minus 3 so 4 equal to 5 so that is not equal to 5 so that is called imperfect frame particularly imperfect frame so there are 4 is less than 5 so is the less than 5 we can take that is deficient frame so this frame is deficient frame okay now we can take the another frame like this okay here the members equal to 1 2 3 4 5 6 so there are six members and uh, j joints equal to there are four joints are there so now we can take uh, 6 equal to 2 into 4 minus 3 so now 6 equal to 8 minus 3 6 not equal to 5 okay so now we can take n is greater than 2j minus 3 so this frame is called redundant frame so this is the method we can find out the perfect frame or imperfect frame in particularly imperfect frame there are deficient frame and redundant frame is over there okay so uh, again we will see next video thank you